Just by watching the very end of Republican Congressman Jason Chavitz's town hall, you can tell how it all went. God bless you. God bless you. The Utah Republican was also booed before he even said a word when he took the stage. And in the midst of the event in the Salt Lake City suburb of Cottonwood Heights, easy, easy, please, please, come on, come on, we're better this. The kind of reception he's not accustomed to in a reliably Republican state, and in a district he won with about three quarters of the vote. Republican politicians facing fiery backlashes at Republican town halls from Utah to Tennessee at this town hall sponsored by the college Republicans at Middle Tennessee State University in Murfreesboro much anger that the town hall auditorium only had a capacity for 78 people we've had previous events where we were let in even though there were fire codes and we sat on the stairs if we don't get it shut it down inside three state legislators and congressman Diane Black the current acting chair of the House Budget Committee. We're going to um, repeal the Affordable Care Act and we're going to replace it with something that is going to be good for the American people. For the most part, that statement didn't go over so well. I, I can't put all my trust in someone saying, we're going to make a plan, but we've had six years and we don't have a plan. Mm -hmm. Exactly. Good question. Besides the, the, the quote that was by the president that if you like your plan, you can keep it, which was one of the greatest lies of, the, of our oh, time. Oh, give it up. Get um, on to the question. Was, the second was that the Republicans don't have a plan. As a matter of fact, um, Paul Ryan had a plan even before the Affordable Care Act. Um, Where was it? Even for some of the people in the crowd who don't like Obamacare, unhappiness, there is no new plan ready to go. You're sitting in the chair. What's the hold up? Uh, the hold up is that we want to do it right. Uh, and and how like many years? The, Obama the anger from Americans in these opening weeks of the Trump administration. A deja vu to the anger heard from protesters at the beginning of Barack Obama's presidency and what would become the Tea Party movement. This past weekend, California Republican Congressman Tom McClintock left his town hall early. A gauntlet of police surrounding him, offering him protection after he too found he had plenty of angry constituents. Gary Tuckman, CNN, Murfreesboro, Tennessee.